All right, once you're in Gmail, you'll click on this tab on the top called Sites. Once you click on Sites, you'll see an option to create a Google site. Um, you'll notice that these are a list of my Google sites uh, that I've already created. You can create um, uh, probably as many as you'd like. Um, for now, click Create. And you'll see some options uh, available. One is a blank template, and then there's some other templates. Um, for now, go ahead and click blank template, and then give your site a name. When you're naming your site, you want to use capital letters and spaces, um, and also use your first uh, and last name. So for example, I could call this Carrie Valentine Portfolio Site. Um, I'm going to give this a number because I know I've already created a site with this name before. Um, it's going to tell me my URL for my site. Notice how all of these letters are, are lowercase, um, but this is the title that will show up on the page. So I want to make sure I have capital letters and spaces. Um, I can go ahead and select a theme, um, which we'll do at this time. So click select a theme and go ahead and choose one that you like. Um, for now, I'm going to choose Garden. Okay, and keep scrolling down, and you'll be asked to type in a code. So go ahead and type in this code. And then click Create. Okay, so you'll see that it has applied the template uh, to my page. It's basically just a web page. Um, if I wanted to edit anything in this page, I would click this little pencil. It says Edit Page. The other thing is uh, an option to create a new page, which we're not going to do yet. Um, there's also More, which allows you to manage your site um, and change page settings. Um, for now, go ahead and click Edit Page. Okay. Because this is your home page, this would be a good place for you to introduce yourself. So go ahead and write a few things about yourself um, and really focus on what you hope to learn this semester. So what you hope to learn ah, and edit 2000 this semester. Okay. I'd also like for you to insert a picture of yourself. Um, so what you can do is Go to Insert, and you'll see it has an option for Image. Okay, And you'll either browse for the image on your desktop, um, or you can find an image at a web address. I, I tend to upload images uh, that I've saved to my desktop, therefore it's easy for me to find them. Um, I'm going to go ahead and insert this picture. This is a very old picture of me from 1980. Um, and then I will click OK. Now you notice how large this picture is. I mean, that's, that's a really large picture for a home page. So I'm going to change the size of it. Um, you'll notice that it has a line left, center, or right. And I can also adjust the size of the image to be small, medium, or large. So I'm going to click medium and see what happens. All right, that looks like a much better size. Um, so now I will click save. And this is what the home page will look like. You'll have more that you've typed here. Um, so this concludes the first part of creating your Google site.